Hello, hello, my darling. How are you today? Are you doing well today? I'm trying to make sure this doesn't pull my shirt down. We don't want that. Are you doing well today? You having a good day? Today is Monday. Monday the 29th. I remember that because nine's my lucky number. Most of the time on like the 9th, 19th, 29th, I always remember the date. <laughs> Y'all, I am trying to wear contacts and buddy, boy, whew, I don't like them. <laughs> I do not like them. I'm trying, but boy, they've been burning my eyes so bad. My eyes are burning like crazy right now because I was trying to wear them earlier, but I had to end up taking them out. I don't know if maybe my eyes are just too dry for contacts or if they have the prescription wrong. I don't know, but buddy, boy, it was uncomfortable. I put them in early this morning and the lady, you know, said that for a little while they won't feel the most comfortable and like it might take a minute for me to get used to them and so I felt like I gave them a good hard try I was like giving myself hours for my body to be used to them I don't I don't know I'm gonna keep trying probably and just see how they do but they were not comfortable. Not comfortable at all. I hope y'all can see me well. I did the stupidest thing. I'm so frustrated with myself for doing it. <laughs> so, y'all know that I do a lot of car chat videos. Obviously, that's what I'm doing right now. Um, but... What I do is I'll have the back of the phone facing me, like right now. Um, and that's so that way y'all can get the best quality video possible. Sorry. So y'all can get the best quality video possible. I have the back of the phone facing me. And that's just using the back camera. God, my eyes are burning so bad right now. Um, but that means that I can't tell what it's video in like um I can't see to make sure I'm in frame stuff like that so the other day it was Thursday I worked out then I came out I set my phone up and I had it recording on the way home well silly me I had it recording the other way and I looked so cute, too. I did. I looked so dang cute that day. I wish it would have got me. <laughs> so, it was like a whole 15-minute video I had to throw out because it was recording me the wrong way. Yeah, that sucks. That was frustrating. So, the video that's coming out today, Monday, is going to be just a half a video because... Silly me, did it the wrong dang way. Oh my goodness gracious, y'all, my eyes hurt so bad right now. Goodness gracious. Yeah, so I started watching it because I was getting together the car chat video for today and started watching I'm like oh god oh no please tell me I didn't <laughs> and there was a dump truck back there um oh what is this fella doing There was a dump truck back there um, that something fell out from under him, it looked like. No telling. Try 
trying to think about which place I need to turn. Yeah, I need to turn here, I think. So I'm just running a quick errand and then uh, go back and get some more work done. I think me and my assistant are gonna go for a nice walk today. Go have lunch. It's a beautiful, beautiful day. So, let's see, what did I do this weekend? Um, this weekend, sorry I'm sniffling. I think me putting like the drops in my eyes and something to do with the contacts and stuff really messed my eyes up and my nose. You know, it's all connected in there. So, um, this weekend, me and a bunch of girlfriends went on a sunset boat cruise and it was so much fun. Um, it was supposed to be like some acoustic music and it was acoustic music, but like they had the speaker really turned up a little too loud because <laughs> it was like this boat that only fit like, I don't know, 25, 30 people or 20 to 30 people, something like that. Huh. Um, and there was this person playing music, acoustic music, but he had it hooked up to a speaker. It was like this keyboard thing or whatever. And it was so loud for such a little space. And so you're sitting there trying to talk and it was like just a little bit much, but the view was absolutely beautiful and the company was amazing. So that's great. So that was a lot of fun. And then, um, I went to a festival this weekend that was so much fun so I don't want to say what kind it was because I don't want to give away like the location but it was a festival that was about some type of produce <laughs> and it was so much fun but it was like way too overcrowded dude way too many people in a small space so like the um the lanes everybody was walking in it was like four streets kind of shut down three or four streets shut down and um all this like food and arts and crafts and all that stuff and that was great and the company was amazing i made the best friends but um just the crowds were a lot y'all i i love getting out and doing stuff but man i don't love packed sardine like crowds it's just a little too much for me and like I have a little bit of social anxiety not major not crippling or anything but a little bit of social anxiety enough to where I want to do meet and greets for y'all but I am pretty nervous about it and no y'all would be wonderful but I'm also really nervous about like getting in a situation like that um so I was just a little overwhelmed by all the people there was like I think somebody was saying like for this entire weekend there was going to be like 50,000 people there and that's a lot of people in a small area, you know? And this is not a big town. This is like a town of like three or 4,000 people. So it's a little, a little much, a little much. <laughs> but like always, always try to make the best out of every situation I'm in. So I had a good time. It's 
funny because what I do for a career, I have lots of pictures and videos I do of myself. But when I'm out at places like that with like lots of people around, I always get nervous about taking pictures of myself, so I don't. So there were so many cute things I wish I would have got pictures with, but I didn't because I was just shy. I forgot to tell my assistant about me going to that festival. I need to tell her about it. I gotta decide where we want to go to lunch today. I am starving, but I didn't want to eat anything right now because I want to be really hungry for going to lunch. This Friday, I'm going to have a little bit of a self-care day. So, I've got a massage booked. Now, it's it's not like a relaxation massage, though. It's um, the lady I've been telling y'all about that I've been going to to help with my shoulder and neck pain. Um, and then, I am getting a facial, which I haven't done in a long time. Last time I got a facial was August when I went on the... Um, I went running around for like my birthday. Yeah, I did some nice things for myself for my birthday in August. And, um, yeah. That's the last time I've had one. Which, for us regular people, that's not a big deal. But a lot of influencers, I think, get a lot of those things done very often. <laughs> Gracious, y'all, my eyes is bothering me. Sorry, I need to quit complaining about it, don't I? Nobody wants to hear a complainer. Alright, y'all, I'm stopping it a lot. I'm going to go in here and take care of this, and I'll be back to video some more. Alright, darling, I am all done. Easy peasy, huh? Just had a quick errand I had to run. So now I am heading back to the house and gonna go out and have some lunch. Don't know what kind of food I feel like today. Some are just open for dinner, but um, I wish more were open for lunch. Goodness gracious. <sighs> Everybody slammed on the brakes real quick. There was a bit of traffic my way here so I'm going a little different way to kind of avoid it. I'm expecting a work call in a couple minutes so I might have to cut y'all a little bit short if I don't get home in time. If I get home in time we can cut off then but if it gets to be right around the time I'm going to need to get that call I might have to cut y'all off a little short. But I know y'all understand. You know how it is. Gotta make that money, honey. Huh? So, speaking of festivals. 
festivals. Like I was telling y'all, I went to that festival this weekend. What kind of festivals do y'all have around where you live? Like every different area has different festivals. Be it like a strawberry festival, a blueberry festival, a blackberry festival, a corn festival, uh, um, a watermelon festival, uh, whatever. What kind of festivals do y'all have right around where you live? I'd love to know. And if you are in America, I'd really love to know, do y'all have festivals over produce like we do? We are so big here about having festivals about produce. <laughs> like, no matter what is uh, ripe or whatever, whatever crop we have, that's the kind of festival we have. So I'd love to know, do y'all do the same? And I know it all stems back from like way back when, when everybody did the farming um, and the crop came around, everybody would have a, like a party to celebrate the hard work and the crop. Just like in fall, you have like the harvest parties, that kind of stuff. But I'd love to know, do y'all have the same kind of thing in different countries? I find it so interesting. America we're big about our festivals and it's like some of it is very individual to the area you live and some of it is completely the same like you know at most festivals you have like the corn dog stand the cotton candy stand the, the fried Oreo stand <laughs> that kind of stuff I love trying all the different meats at the places, like the barbecue sandwiches, the turkey legs, the uh, pork chop sandwiches, the, all the different things like that. Do y'all like to cook? I do. I love to cook so much. <clears throat> Excuse me. Speaking of pork chop sandwiches, um, I have this really amazing recipe that I make that's a pork chop and you crush up pretzel crumbs and you, or pretzels, and you bread it with pretzel crumbs and then you fry it and then you put it on like a bun with um, this Thousand Island kind of sauce and now, speaking of that, it's making me crave it. <laughs> I'm hungry. I can't wait to eat dinner. <laughs> or lunch, whatever it is. Oh, it's almost time for me to get on the call. I don't think I'm going to make it home. Sorry about all the bouncing. I think I'm gonna have to let y'all go before I get there. But lots of bouncing. Sorry, I'm trying to get through these people. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm gonna have to let y'all go. I'm sorry. We didn't make it all the way home, but I still love you. And I hope you have an amazing, wonderful day. And don't forget.